Hi, my name is Karolina Halatek. I'm uh, from Poland. I um, had the pleasure to be a resident artist at Lomayer Sculpture Park uh, in St. Louis. Uh, so I used my time for um, to produce an art piece actually during my time. So actually it was three weeks. So I would like to share with you the results of, of my stay as an example of, of uh, the thinking I'm, I'm having with about the art generally. So I created, I created the site-specific piece. Uh, and um, just to, in the very beginning, I can tell you that the Meyer Sculpture Park is, uh, for, is free. So everyone can enter uh, and, um, and uh, it's a huge space. So a lot of people just uh, you know, go for a weekend, a lot of families go. Uh, you know, to spend time. Uh, there is a lot of public that is not really relate, like doesn't relate. It's not like a typical art public, like a museum public. So um, I could pick up any space, uh, any uh, any space in the park, and I could just create an EP kind of piece. Uh, so I like the shelters in the back of the uh, back of the park by the forest. And what I've done, I just transformed the space. Uh, I, um, people who, who from the community in St. Louis, from the area, knew that uh, shelters uh, as a kind of uh, stop for a picnic or, you know, like just having some sort of like a, a camp, like a campsite for you, for teenagers. So what I've done, I built the walls, like translucent, I used translucent material. I built the walls um, and uh, I used light and uh, I put a uh, smoke, like fog inside. I called the piece Cloud Square. And uh, so I actually I just wanted to, to let people in, uh, like to create this sort of like heavenly kind of experience of sky. Um, or you know that kind of space where you can, uh, where you can reflect, where you can, um, uh, where you can take your time and be contemplative. Uh, oh, this is the shelter. This is how it looked. So I created the frame, and uh, I think this is the last image. Yeah. So uh, let's going back to the first one. Um, what I decided to do is I, the people were queuing, the line was very long, like for six hours, for six hours, and uh, nearly six hours, there was like, you know, tons of people, people had to be like, crowd had to be uh, controlled by, by like 10 people coming in. But um, what was important for me was uh, the, the openness that everyone could access for free. Uh, I wanted to create this space, like a square, like a place of like everyone can meet, like you have in a, like downtown, I mean, in Europe, you have the square where everyone gathers. So that, that's why the, the piece is called Cloud Square. So I wanted to create a place where kind of everyone is invited and uh, it's very, uh, it's the space that is very um, free and um, kind of democratic, in a way, in the in the character. So um, and also brings people together, so they have an experience like a collective experience. And this, um, in a very short moment, let's say in some minutes, they could be together and they can interact together. So they could, uh, I don't know, ask to take a picture. You know, they could interact with each other within that um, that area. So they, in fact, they could maybe, uh, you know, become like friends with neighbors, or you know, there was a possibility a bit of space for interaction, but within very particular uh, experience, which was abstract and, uh, and reflective. Uh, so uh, that immersion that came out before as a topic is like, I wanted to, uh, to immerse people in a moment when people can actually 
like uh, reset or they can uh, have time for themselves they have a time to enjoy the the life or they can just uh, uh, stop uh, being worried and uh, i think that all this critical thinking and discussion that we have needs some kind of a proposal so it's very good to point out uh, you know the, the, the have a critical view but then the proposal that you were also asking was the was the solution was the was what can you propose is i think that kind of art or this kind of art piece or this kind of art pieces that makes it possible